Hey guys, Alex from Motorcycles Vancouver at the Abbotsford 2015 Motorcycle Show. And I'm here with Troy today. Troy, he's here with rideintohistory.ca. Which is an upcoming charity ride here in Vancouver. And he's also here representing the Salvation Army. So let's talk about the ride. What's going on with the, uh, with the organization? All right, well, July 24th and 25th, We've got a cruise-in concert that's happening on the 24th of July. We're going to be at the Fort Langley Fort, a national historic site for British Columbia. It was one of the first spots opening in this province. So we're going to be there. We're going to have music. We're going to have cars and bikes. We're going to have food. We're going to have a lot of fun. And uh, there'll be lots of people out. And then on the Saturday, for those that have registered with us, we're going for a motorcycle ride. Very cool. And uh, we'll go out, cover out the valley and come work our way back. Milestones is going to make us a beautiful dinner and uh, all the proceeds are going to help support Salvation Army. Ah, so the ride's also going to be directly helping the Salvation Army. Absolutely. Salvation Army is a very good charity organization based out of here in Canada. Yeah. Primarily, correct? Well, they it's They do a, a lot in the U.S., but is it originally you from know Canada? What? It's an international organization. It is, yes. And, uh, but we have, uh, we have some good roots here in Canada. It's definitely solid. Uh, there's a lot of ministry units here that are reaching out, and there's all kinds of things happening in that regard, whether it's right at street level, it could be at uh, thrift stores, could be food support, could be helping with services and um, all kinds of things like uh, medical rooms. And Outreach programs. All kinds of things, yep. yeah. So it's really, really an amazing, amazing thing. And we were just talking, you had mentioned that Salvation Army spends less than 10% of all their money on marketing. Yeah, so one of the mandates uh, for the Salvation Army is that we keep that administration cost very small. And so it's uh, it's a written in stone, so they, uh, they make sure that it does not go above that. And so uh, an event like this is one of those things that's really good for uh, the Salvation Army because all the proceeds are going directly in. That's why we love interviewing these guys when we're here at the motorcycle shows. So the ride's coming up when? July 24th and 25th. And we can get tickets for that where? Yeah, all right online, rideintohistory.ca. You can sign up online and uh, get yourself in there. Rideintohistory.ca. Okay, and your branch, you also do associate directly with the Salvation Army. Absolutely. So let's talk a little bit about that. How did you get involved with the charity originally? Well, you know what? I was asked to come and help with a new project that was happening in Langley, British Columbia, and I uh, was uh, really interested, excited about that. And uh, so I've been there now for a few years, six, and, uh, and uh, yeah, it's good. It's good. Uh, you know what? If you could see some of the things that are happening in this 31,000 square foot building, it's just an amazing facility. Everything from daily trying to give somebody a bed all the way up to having them longer term and helping them train and learn Able's, and grow. The skill set so they, Absolutely. Can, they can go out on their own and, and make a beautiful life. Yeah, you know, one of the things that's most important is to be able to give those uh, options for somebody to make those steps forwards. And once they have that, oh, they go places. They really do. It's, it's such a rewarding feeling. Uh, two years ago, uh, I, a young man stopped me on the street and he said, I get a little choked up when I talk about it. And he said, Alex. He says, do you remember me? And I said, no, no, no. And he said, two years ago, you gave me a sandwich. Um, and that was the day I knew everything had to change. So he said that was the, he went and got his hair cut. He went and, did, he went, he got, he went and got some help with the associations. He went into the, uh, the government facilities. He got some social services. And within two weeks, he had a job and he was living in his own house again. You know what that is? That's a personal touch. Right. And he said it was just because no one took the time to say hi. No one cared. Mm -hmm. And uh, I... Every time I, I hear about these guys doing things like that, I, I always get a little teary eyed. You know, it hits me right here, guys. So, hey, thanks awesome. for talking with us. Yeah, thank you. Rideintohistory.ca and Salvation Army. Make sure you guys check it out. It's North American and worldwide. Absolutely. Sign up soon. Sign up soon. And uh, you guys giving anything away in the uh, contest this oh, year? Oh, there'll be lots of giveaways. Yeah, so we're doing a raffle, too, so we'll check you out on the website. Awesome. Thanks for your time, guys. This is Alex at the Abbotsford Motorcycle Show 2015. See you later. Thanks for watching another one of our interviews at the 2015 International Motorcycle Show. If you'd like to see some more interviews, click on to the uh, lower boxes there. We've got an interview with Ride to Live. We've got some interviews with a few other people. We've got a goodbye biker video as well there where I helped a blind man. So make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Check out the rest of our videos. And dive into some of our old back catalog if you want to get some real funny stuff going on. Thanks for watching guys. It means a lot.